Hello everyone, so hope you all doing good. Uh, well, this video contains my Ask of Fish Tank update. Uh, well, uh, you can ask any questions regarding the freshwater aquariums, not a salt water because I'm not a pro in it. Well, I, I don't say that I'm a pro in any freshwater aquariums too, but, but I, I have um, uh, most of the knowledge in the freshwater aquariums. So, well, uh, I, can create, I can answer each and every of your questions. Uh, well, uh, well, you can shoot out any questions and uh, I'll, I'll really make sure that I, I just answer every, each and every uh, question what you what you guys just want to know uh, know about the freshwater aquariums well uh, within it's not wasting more time well I'm gonna I'm gonna show my uh, Oscar fish tank uh, which is which is really cool uh, well my aim of uh, this video I mean just starting this video is just I, I want to make sure that uh, most uh, as much as people I mean as many as people have to keep aquariums in their home because it's really cool actually pretty awesome so guys without wasting much time well you're gonna see the Oscar fish tag well this is my aquarium well I have two albedo Oscars and two tiger oscars is here and i'll give update on each and every fish well this is the salvani chips which i have a pair of them and also i have a catfish albino catfish uh, which they also say it's in a freshwater aquarium shark which i don't think it is a shark at any point so I just call him as a catfish so well these are uh, Salwani no not Salwani Venuses have four baby Venuses chislet which is pretty cool there I have two of them here and uh, two will be somewhere we I have to just go and search for them because they are very slow and very small enough to then I have a yellow laps, four yellow laps, and this is the tiger Oscar. Yellow laps, seriously. Wow. You can just ask me any question about this freshwater fishes. Uh, I mean, uh, what fishes are good to start with, and what is the tank setup and all. Uh, I I have not. Uh, inserted much gravel into my tank because um, it's very easy for me to clean without more gravel uh, which I feel well I have some very less of substrate and this is Oscar again these are albino Oscars so you can just watch them clearly this is an albino Oscar well, you just I want to make sure that you guys get a very clear view of it. But most probably these Oscar fishes are really cool. Well, I have uh, a heater for them. And there a pleco in there. A very small baby pleco. pleco which is called a sucker fish, a sucker cat or a cleaner fish. Whatever. Um, I'm new to DSLR so uh, I have I'm getting some time to adjust uh, the lenses and the angles and the clearance of the water and all well, well that's a heater I maintain 28 degrees of temperature well these are the salvani chislet uh, I don't know why but uh, salvani chislet only one chislet it takes a color off sometimes not too not every time but all this one where is it? Alright. So these are my Oscars. Uh, especially this is Oscar tank update. So I'm gonna focus on Oscars today. But Oscar fish are very cool fish to keep. And uh, and they are. Especially they have to take care about the food habits. Because Oscar, Oscar fishes won't eat whatever. The regular pellets. Because they. They most probably feed on the. Uh, blood worms and. Uh, whatever the live fish stuff. Well, yes, you guys have a question. Uh, might be asking, might be have getting a doubt that how I 
I need you to keep a baby Venuses with these Oscars because Oscars gonna kill them and actually eat them for no reason. But yes, there is a chance that when you feed your Oscars uh, without keeping them hungry, they can be with any fish. Well, for me it worked. I actually experiment keeping the fishes small sizes with the big sizes so I just do that for me it just worked and, and they're doing fine and I'm happy for that well there is another Oscar over there uh, well yes that's another tiger Oscar uh, it's well the time Well, these Oscar fish are seriously, uh, well, they, they are pretty cool fish actually to keep with because they actually recognize their owners. That's a very good in that Salvani Chislin again, and we have this is something new. Wow, wow. Uh, this one is Salvani Chislin. And this is again yellow lab. This is yellow lab chisel. I have four of them. And this again I'll be in Oscar. So for, so this is what I say. I have this Venus there. You can see two uh, the catfish and two Venuses and uh, somewhere around these. I think it's actually a feeding time for them, so they're just looking for the food. I should just quickly answer the fish there. It is. Oh, it went on somewhere. No, it's not. Oh, the Venus just. Did. Well, this is my fish tank, which is uh, three feet. So actually, I this time I wanted to keep Oscar fishes in it. If you see my previous uh, up uploads, you can see uh, a flower on a short body flower on with uh, peacock chestnut, uh, blue peacock chestnut, and some other Malwai chestnut. Um, but unfortunately. Uh, the flower on has, has died so since I've taken some time and I then put uh, piranhas and uh, some green terrors in it but then again the tank uh, I don't know what happened but the tank got leaked so again I took them took some time and I made it repair and now I'm just preparing these Oscars and this time I want to make sure that everything is perfect for them so well, I have a full uh, coming to this tank. Uh, as I said earlier, the gravel is only. Uh, I have just put a very few, very much less gravel actually, because I want to make sure uh, that, that there is no disturbances uh, when when I'm cleaning. Because uh, if the gravel is more, then the dust will always deposited the town. Now also you can just uh, see the dust is already deposited the town at the bottom. Uh, with this less gravel and if I have a more gravel over there then that, that's gonna be a very problem for me uh, uh, I found that that's just my point of view so I just put a very low gravel over there so I'm pretty happy and the fish also look good look happy um, well just coming to the point keeping four baby Venuses with Oscars uh, and keeping a catfish with Oscars well, uh, this is a different kind of experiment to be frank when I talk to them, when I talk to the point of it. And, um, well, yes, it works but because obviously the chaslers are faster. That's one reason and another reason are these. Then I have some very small hiding spots for these small, small micro chaslers. So again, and they go and they also grow, they won't stop there. And, uh, and also the feeding four times uh, like I'm feeding my Oscars four times I mean not only Oscars but all the fishes four times that's also, that's also another reason for 
for them just keeping calm without doing any harm to the uh, venuses her baby venuses and and well just so far this is a pretty cool tank and uh, and this tank is just uh, just open top i don't have any top to them uh, because i want to make sure the light just flows directly into the tank well yes i'm planning to put some glass on it uh, i don't know when i'm gonna make it but, but definitely i'm gonna make it well guys if you want to just show just see how these orca fishes just come up then uh, well yes the fishes should come up right now but i don't know why but it's not coming now oh no i think we have spotted the camera on uh, so well yes Guys, any questions about the Oscar fishes uh, well, or any suggestions about them or just any suggestions about them? Any suggestions or uh, anything which I have to improve on the shooting? Uh, well, I know the zoom in and zoom out, I have to improve it more. Well, there's not, now they came up. Well, you can clearly see now they came up because there's a food time for them. Uh, you can now see. Oh, right. Yeah, some. Oh, well, 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 well. No, 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 no. Oh, my God. Oh, why are we doing this? Lances. I don't know somewhere. I just mention. I have to make sure. I have to make sure. Well. <clears throat> yeah, that's cool. Pretty cool, right now. All these are my Oscar fishes from the top, and these are open top, and you can just clearly see my fish is down. All this good. Oh, wow, wow, this is crazy. Well, yes. uh, well, guys, this is, the, this is my first video, so uh, if you don't like anything, uh, just let me know so that I just make, uh, just make a good. And I take care of everything which you guys don't like. Well, please, no negative comments. If you have any suggestions, let me know so that I can make a good videos for you guys. And it's okay, I won't beg for any subscriptions or something uh, because just I want to make sure that as much as aquariums you guys just want to. I mean, I want to make sure that each and everyone has at least one aquarium in home. That's my aim. So, so no begging for some subscriptions or something because i'm not i don't want to get anything about this anything out of this i just want to just share my knowledge on these fishes and uh, these freshwater aquariums so that many people have many issues with the cleaning and all well let's shoot out the questions i'll let's get back to you in the preview in the next vlogs uh with the answers and all and i make sure that i just reply most of your questions if possible to everyone's question. Well guys, so now for today. Well the close up shots a couple of close close videos for them. I just want to make sure the ask is just well these are my Oscar fishes. Uh, I have one albino Oscar. Uh, actually, another one is a uh, red Oscar, maybe. Oh, I exactly don't know what another one is. And uh, well, this is my tank. I have four yellow laps just in it. Well, I can just show you each and everything very closely. Close look to them. The actually where the Oscar fish. Obviously, the coolest fish to keep in aquariums because they do just go 